All right, everybody, welcome back to another video today. We're playing some Caitlyn in the mid lane. We're running First Strike, Boots, Biscuits, Cosmic Insight, Eyeball, and Ultimate Hunter. Someone Sniper Caitlyn's sure. back. Everybody's going Lethality Caitlyn this patch because the Lethality items are very overtuned. So that means Sniper Caitlyn is going to be very, very strong. So I'm going to build a Collector first because... Caitlyn benefits from that three times because the crit increases her Never alt damage. The AD and the lethality also increase her damage too. So it's the perfect first item if you're able to grab that first. And then second, we can either go Axiomark, Hubris. I think those two are the, the good ones. Their team's pretty squishy though. I would try to fit like an LDR into my build for more alt damage, but I probably won't need that till really late game. Against a Vagar. He's probably just looking to farm, but I don't want to leave him alone for too long. I'm here to protect. Because he does he'll get a point where he's stronger than me, and we don't want to let him hit that. So once I can get this wave pushing towards him. We can poke him with a really long range. But if I do push out, then the horseman's going to come get us. So maybe we just go for a wee bit of poke. Trying to hit him with a Q. I don't want to spam the Qs too much, though. Because I'm not going to be building any mana items. So I want to make my shots count. Because I don't have too many of them. But we're going to get some big alt damage with this build, and we'll make money by alting, too. It's not like the good old days where I'd alt with first strike and get, like, hundreds of gold. So he nerfed it to the ground. But it's still still probably the best rune you could take for this. Just because you're long range, you're going to hit enemies first, get more activations. Couldn't have walked into that more, but you know what? We'll chase them all the way back. Oh, that Q even hit. So, Caitlyn's Q does double damage to the first target hit. So, if you hit, like, a minion first and then hit somebody with a Q, it does basically half damage. But, if they step on a trap and you Q them, it does full damage even if it hits a minion first, which I didn't even know that. He still pushed me out of turret. Almost. Well, at least we didn't have to burn Flash or Barrier. But I'm kind of low. So let's just force an all in. I don't think I needed to Barrier there, but I mean, look how low I am. I did block some minion damage. Uh, no, no, no. Leave. It'll push into me. I mean, as long as Hecarim doesn't come in and just crash into the turret, that's fine. He's going to TP back anyway. If I stay, I die. Let's grab some lethality and a potion. Yeah, I needed to get out of that lane. Luckily, he flashed pretty late. If he flashed my net, he would have 100% lived. But I don't think he thought I was going to do that much damage or be able to hit him after he flashed away. So, I mean, I kind of want to try and build a Hubris eventually because this stacks up AD. But I need to be able to, like, confidently get more kills before I get it because it's kind of like a stacking item. If I'm not getting any kills, I'm not stacking it up. If we can get fed enough, we can get to the point where... I could just ult somebody at half HP and they'll always die. So that's why actually Mark might be better second item. I want to help them. Oh, wow. Look at that Q damage already. Yeah, I got a grub. How much gold do I get for those? I didn't even see. Oh, got him. Nice. 
I mean, they didn't hit any of the traps, but I have so many. I don't really want to trade a Teemo. Yeah, I don't know if he has Ignite or not. And he probably could have killed me there if he had Flash Ignite. Hmm, not in a good spot here. My barrier's almost back up, but Vagar is probably hitting level 6 off these minions. He doesn't have Flash, so he can't just Flash army, but he can hit a stun on me and then just press R. So I need to just chill back. Not by a long shot. Shouldn't have queued that wave. Ekram's bot. Emo's dead. Darn. I want to hit him for the... Uh... I'm going to E that just because I can auto it from really far away then. Because I don't want to get hit by his stun. We'll get out of here. Yeah, I've seen Caitlyn's go Ghostblade first. I haven't seen Hubris first, but I feel like it's even better than Ghostblade. Ghostblade's good for bot lane because you need the mobility. Um, I'll just save my money here. I could go Hubris second. 60, 18, 15. This gives so much haste, though. No matter the situation, a good investigator always remains calm. I think he's dead. At least MF got it. I don't think we can do anything about that dragon or botlings there. I'll make this quick. Oof. Yeah. Better just to not fight that. Oh, River Height. I love you. Ah. Uh, maybe should have kept autoing him. Well, my flash is back up, so Vagar's is too. I should have flashed forward, maybe, and just kept going for Hecarim, because I kind of knew Vagar was going to block that. Should have queued instead of E, is out of range. It's okay, though. I get wave in. And he's going to have to base. If he TPs, I could put Trap right here. And since we got two of the Grubs, it's easier. Oh my god. Wow. I don't even have an item yet, and that's how much damage I'm dealing, guys. I'm into such a good comp, too, because I think Hecarim will be the only one that's going to be hard to kill, but he shouldn't get, like, too tanky. Oh, I get another plating because of that trap, so... Caitlyn is insanely good versus hourglasses and traps. Or not traps, teleports. I got a base, but I think I got a push. If I push this wave in, Vagar shouldn't be able to roam up. I can't. I have no mana. I'm useless. But I'll run there. Let's start building Hubris or Axiomark. I'll turn it into either. The thing is, I don't know if I have enough mana to just Axiom Arc all like crazy. MF's got four kills. She didn't go Swifty, so... MF's super fast with Ghostblade. We got one of the Grubs again, so I mean, it's, th it's gonna be three and three. That's fine, because then neither team gets to spawn them. I must always be three steps ahead. Which have I gotten from this? 124? Not terrible, because I save another 300 in boots. Oh, that hit him. Ekra may come around mid again. I'll just be ready. My E. Hmm. 
Maybe can ult him. I think I need first strike up. Well, if he bases off that... I think my ult kills like I'm gonna wait for first strike. Oh, it is up. Yeah, that's free. <laughs> I was like, you know, I have a collector. It should definitely kill him. I don't know if I got any first strike money because it was one shot. I wasn't paying attention. I might have. You know, Hecarim spot. Just shred this. I would actually argue that grubs are almost more important. I think they are more important than getting the Rift Herald. Rift Herald can really chunk a turret, but grubs are for the whole game. They they probably should make grubs fall off at like 20 minutes or something. Because late game, if you your team has grubs, you just like kill every turret. Oh, the Q didn't hit. If the Q hit, he'd be really low. Okay, I'm almost out of mana again. I gotta shove. But Hecarim is below me in the river, I think. If he walks up, that's just a giveaway that I'm getting ganked. Okay, what are we going? Kind of want to try this. We'll get cooldown boots, more ults. I mean, the nice thing is these lethality items build into the same stuff. Oh, actually, they don't. I'm going Hubris, I guess. <laughs> Axiom Mark builds out of... There's. It's so weird. There's the Dirk and there's Brutalizer now. On my way, I might be able to pick someone. I do massive amounts of damage, but if I get CC'd, I'm going to die. Oh, watch out for a Zoe bubble. That guy's dead. Wow, did I just I just autoed her once. That's all I hit her with. It should be a kill. Right. If he has alt, I'm probably dead. He doesn't. I want the dragon. I have barrier. I can survive Hecarim. He's actually... Oh, he's going lethality. That's perfect. Lethality Hecarim's actually pretty... Let's see if she comes over the wall or something. Le lethality Hecarim's bad if, if he continues to keep going lethality. Because he'll be squishy and he won't even deal that much more than going tank. So this spin sixteen hundred. I hit him with a Q. I was gonna just alt him to get some gold. Sixteen fifty. I'll stay another wave. It maybe hit a Q over this one. Oh, it did hit. I mean, if I'm under turret, I should be fine. I'm not here to say. I have a little bit of life steal on my Doran's blade. If I hit him with another Q, I might be able to kill him. Nice Graves is going tanky, and so is Warwick. So I'll have front line. I'm not going to be good versus Teemo Shrooms, though, is the thing that sucks. I'll have to kind of stay mid the whole game. Wow. Okay, that is hurting. If I'm able to go, like, LDR later, then I can throw in Quick Blades. I'll have 60% crit, and crit increases all damage, but... Oh, actually, I don't need to sell that. Oh, we're gonna win. Okay, he TP'd. 
Used Herald top two, which is good. Uh, their bot lane might come try and get my turret, though. If I get hit by Zoe Bubble, I think that's what's going to kill me more than a Vagar cage. Oh my god. That's really good. I just need to hit her with one spell to get her out of my lane. Damage, but you did make me miss a cannon. I don't want to spam too much. Got MF flash. I think Zoe flash too. I'm not 100% sure. Should be the hubris. Alright. I mean, it's not too hard to pick up kills. And the thing is, once I get hubris, I just need one kill. And then I have extra AD for 90 seconds to work with. So, next item we go. Oh, I want. I mean, we could just go Axie Mark next. This is okay. I mean, a hundred extra damage on my net auto or a trap auto could help. Maybe we try it just to like test out the new items, you know? This thing's really good too. Actually, you know what? This is better. Because this gives lethality when I'm out of combat, so that's just gonna make my ult stronger. Since I'm I sit out of combat for a while and then I just burst. So I actually wanna get that item if I can later. But I only have two more slots left, so one of them might have to be an armor pen for late game. We'll see. Oh, hold on. Oh, I think I actually would have killed him if Morgana didn't help him kill the uh, red. Because he healed off killing it. I will not Ouch, that didn't do any damage. Oh, these are enemies. That like stopped his ult mid midway through. The heart of Piltover is its people. They're coming. Oh, my ult's already back up. He most chunked. He's kind of tanky. Where's my teammates? I think we have to give this. Nobody's in position. Oh, I have a blue buff. Oh, yeah, I won't have to worry about mana later. I got MF. Shut down. He didn't have Trist. I just don't want to lose this mid turret. Darn. I thought I had flash up, but I didn't. Come on, save the turret. You can maybe even kill her. Nice. I think if we had Trist on in that fight, we might have won. I think Vagar flash caged me. I'm not sure what happened. It seems I may have a new suspect. Oh, I get this extra AD even if I die. For some reason I thought it goes away when you die. I remember I was playing the other day and I died after getting a kill and I didn't have the extra damage. Oh, she got bot turret. It's okay. It's whatever. It's my business to know Let's ult for some money. Oh, yeah, half of his HP bar. How much money? 36. I know 
attention to the trap. Even the smallest. Why does he have so much HP? Oh, their jungler's dead. I don't know if Timo's gonna turn around or not. Oh, deleted him. I got more money for that than the alt I did. Oh, Axiom's gonna go crazy. <laughs> okay, that's really good for our hubris. I hope I'm saying this right. Otherwise, if I'm not saying it right, I'm going to come up with a new name for it that's even more wrong just to make people upset. I hope you guys know that. Anytime people start correcting me on me saying something wrong, I'm going to make my own word up. I'm going to have it my way. I just did like 60% of Hecarim's health. Okay, he's going full lethality. I saw him build a health... Oh yeah, he still has the health crystal. I'm like, what does that go into? I mean, I might as well ult again before I base. It's another free like 40 gold. Seven hundred. Oh, that's annoying. I'm just gonna die here. If I flash, I still die. I can't believe they all got to me so fast. Uh, double ghost blades. I don't think they're doing Baron, but Hecarim did go up there. Okay, never mind. They're not doing that. Um. Oh yeah, I want this, and then maybe last item we go. I might go LDR last, cause so, two of them. I mean, just give me HP. They don't really have more HP than me. What are they doing? They're behind our turret. This is why keeping mid. Yo, they're they're crazy. This is why keeping mid turret is so important. Oh, oh. She didn't put the pool down. Oh, I was in range of all. My bad. I should have blue trinket too, so I can. Do this. I have all. Oh, so close. I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah, LDR might be good just because the crit on it increases my alt damage. Oh man. He should have been pinging that somebody was there. Yeah, I just took half of his health. The MF's kind of crazy. She'll run straight at me, which, if I had uh, resources that last time, I could maybe kill her. I need to get a kill, though, for my hubris, but we should take the red. Oh my god, I just crit so many of them. Sit back here. Might be a kill. Oh, and I got team up flash. I'm hurting. Oh, he stole the dragon, though. Almost killed her. Oh, no. He's got the burn. Ouch. How much refund did I get? 29%. To, like, 10 seconds. I mean, we're not getting dragons, but we're winning fights. Chemtech Soul isn't gonna make them auto win. Hextech and Infernal Souls, I do not like playing against the most. Wow. Oh, I don't my Q. Somehow canceled my Q. Oh my god. 
If I can hit another one, I might even kill her. Oh my gosh, so close. That was a close one. Yeah, this is just going to give the... Oh, my. This is going to give the most stats. What is that? Nine. I still can get three more levels. So I might go up to ten. Ten or eleven. What does it cap out at? Ten. Okay. And, I mean, I guess for now, I'll just build lethality. Because they really don't have armor. So I don't actually need the LDR yet. But it might be nice to throw in more crit. But, you know, we'll just keep building lethality. Oh my god. That was like 1100 damage. I just gotta set up traps where I think they'll fight. Where they may go in. Uh, I should have queued where I thought she was going to go, but I thought she would pop out here anyway. I don't think I can get away. Really needed somebody to pop her spell shield. Oh my gosh, my queues are hitting for 1k. Well, I got red at least. I'm healing. Oh, so close. If I had my hubris bonus, he actually would maybe die. Running out of mana. But there goes my flash, which is not good. I think I'm going to buy Red Pot here. I'm going to be full build soon if I just get a few more kills. I'm just going to keep mid alive. We need picks. I think MF got a really good all last fight because I feel like we should have won that one. I want to ult for some early damage, but I might want to save it for the reset on it. Axiom. Never a dull moment. Oh, cool. Rank three all YOLO. Oh, oh my God. I didn't think it was going to do that much damage. We need the blue. We can't lose this one. Oh no. Uh, why do they do that right before dragon? Oh, there goes soul. Oh, they're going to Baron. I don't think we should give Baron. I'll just ult him, get him low. Oh my god. They might not, uh... They might not try to Baron now. Hopefully Graves can just check. Alright, bro. My team is getting out macroed. I think we're losing Baron. I don't see MF on it though. Maybe not. I think my ult on Hacker might have stopped them from doing it. Nice. Five seconds. Calibrating. 
He's really, really low. Okay. Wow. All it took was one of my alts to stop them from doing Baron. That's kind of crazy. Oh, that's a free kill. Yeah, we, we should go to Baron. 460 AD. Really lucky there wasn't an MF around to ult me when Hecarim was jumping on me. The thing that sucks is her spell shield. But at least she like went all the way around for some reason. Is Logic is rare. Okay, 467 AD, I can finish item as well. Okay, yep, we got the one-shot ults. Man, I should really get Edge of Night because this game's kind of losable. Doesn't even build on it. Now nah, I'm actually going to get a 40, 20, 30, 29. I'm going to get this. It's just the crit's better. It gives the same stats as the other one. I don't need the slow. 500 AD, 80 lethality, 30% armor pen. If they don't have any armor, which they don't, I'm doing over true damage, I think. One must never we should just siege mid. Somebody's splitting bot. Warwick should really stop Teemo, because anybody else just dies. Oh, I thought it was Triss. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, Graves got... Graves is getting the wave. Okay. I accidentally flashed, man, but it, it kind of worked out. Because <laughs> I dodged the Hecromolt. Well, good thing I did not get hit by that. I just one-shot that guy. There's Teemo. Where'd he go? Did you beat him? Just let Teemo recall when we're in the game. Okay. Too bad I can't reach the turrets. I think I tried to... Um, where is he? Oh my god, my damage, dude. Oh my god! <laughs> Yo! God damn. Alright. Um, yeah, that kind of went crazy. 47, 47 extra AD. This item's giving me 107 attack damage. Oh man, what a game. It was really fun. Everything went perfect. Like, it was tough, but it was winnable. Team came together. We just got one dragon. That's all we needed. And Morgana got a good pick at the end. Couldn't be a better sniper game. Look at that damage. 63k. Oh, my God. How many pop-ups am I going to get? 63k damage. I think I owe damage my whole team. I did. Just about. The rune stats. I mean, I got 1,700 gold from this, and I could have even sold boots if we had to fight again, and I would have been even stronger. That's insane. These lethality items are super strong because they hardcore nerfed Caitlyn to make her build crit, and if you can still just build lethality and do this much damage, it's the items. So, yeah. Thanks again for watching, guys. Make sure you like, you comment, you subscribe. You go check out my Teemo channel, Swagmo. I upload Teemo games every day on there. I'm climbing up the ranks. So, yeah. See you there. Peace.